What's up guys, Jeff here for Premium Aquatics and today we're going to be taking a look at the new supplements from Emmy Coral. Welcome back to another episode of Premium Aquatics where we take a look at new products each and every week to help you make an informed decision on what is right for you, your reef tank, and your budget. And this week we're going to be taking a look at the new product line from Emmy Coral. So let's jump into it. All right, folks, so we got a package from Premium Aquatics and it should have some new products from Emmy Coral in it. So let's open it up and take a look at what we got going on. Individually wrapped. Uh, a couple of them are individually wrapped. A lot of care went into that one. Kids will have fun with that later. All right, so we got the ME Coral Minor Element Kit. Potassium, strontium, iodine, bromide, and fluoride are all minor elements that are attached to coloration and growth of corals and are very important to maintain the levels of these different elements within your aquarium to have that coloration and growth just booming. One of the best things about ME Coral, and they've kind of set the standard as far as pharmaceutical grade is considered in the hobby. And I believe all of these elements um, in this kit are pharmaceutical grade with the exception of fluoride, which is the purest version of fluoride that you, is available um, on the market. So with a product like this, it's going to be very important to make sure that you're testing for these elements and making sure that if you're going to use this product and make adjustments to these different elements in your reef tank that you are in fact using a test which you know there isn't test kits available for these products. So the use of a ICP test is going to be definitely recommended for a product like this. But Emmy Coral, definitely a awesome, awesome product. Uh, they have always been front runners when it comes to pharmaceutical grade products. And it's just, I'm very excited to see, I'm not gonna open that and talk at the same time. I'm very excited to see that Emmy Coral has gone and put a product like this together and now is available to reef tank August. Potassium is probably one of my most favorite elements to uh, dose in an aquarium. Uh, this alone, you're going to see some immediate coloration changes in your corals, especially your greens and your purples are going to explode uh, with potassium. Potassium, it literally, you can dose your tank, walk away from it, go back maybe in five minutes and notice a different difference with that product. Very high quality bottles. Uh, again, that you know, there's some directions here. It gives you uh, target levels. So with your strontium, uh, your target level is seven to nine parts per million and test appropriately. So it's right on the bottle. So that's awesome that Emmy Coral is, you know, giving people that direction uh, with their products because it is going to be very important to make sure that you are doing some type of testing while using this product. So your iodine, which has a number of different purposes in the tank and definitely is going to help uh, even, wow, awesome. So, all right, so I'll read this right for you. Iodine is used by fish, corals, and algae to grow. Iodine depletes quickly in a modern aquarium and needs to be replenished for optimal coral coloration. Enhances blues and purple colorations in SPS coral. Awesome, so I actually is gonna break it down for you to that level. Uh, natural sea level, 0 0.6 parts per million. Test appropriately. Uh, maintenance dose three to five drops so it's a very concentrated formula in a 26 gallon system one to two times per week and then it breaks down the ingredients and that ingredient list right there and is pretty much the same for all of these products is literally the bare minimum so you have RODI water and potassium iodide awesome Let's see what else they say about the strontium Strontium is used by corals in calcification. Consumption can drop to levels below target level of seven to nine parts per million, test appropriately. And the dose for that is three to five drops, 26 gallon system, one to two times per week. It's a nice looking kit too. 
uh, very well put together and definitely is going to hold up in where you looked at iodine bromide depleted levels will impede growth and coloration of corals test appropriately three to five drops in 26 gallon system one to two times per week and then your fluoride is a minor element utilized by corals and other tank inhabitants depletion can slow growth and coloration in corals maintain seawater level of 1.3 parts per million test appropriately recommendation on the dosage is two to four drops in a 26 gallon system one to two times per week awesome it's very awesome to see that me coral has a product like this that's going to help uh, with coral coloration coral growth and is going to uh, definitely help people make those colors pop in the tank very very awesome we also have a couple other things here let's take a look at what we got i'm going to go ahead and hit the easy button on this one all right so what we have here is the emmy coral phosphate and this is a product that for people that run ultra low nutrient systems uh, they actually need to add phosphates uh, to maintain certain levels in their system and I happen to not be one of those folks that needs to add phosphate to my reef tank because I do a good job of feeding the tank and uh, making sure that the phosphates are present sometimes a little too high but uh, for folks out there that have that filtration system down to a T and need a little bit of phosphates to add to their tank um, ME Coral now has a phosphate product which is going to help those folks keep the colors in the corals and making them look good so i'm going to go ahead and assume that one of these is the nitrate nitrates yep no3 so i'm not going to make you guys suffer through unpackaging this especially with that mic so let's hit the easy button me coral nitrates no3 again you know in conjunction with phosphates both these products are going to be for folks that um, have those ultra low nutrient systems that have those amazing filtration systems that are absolutely kicking the phosphate and nitrates butts and have to add them to make sure that their coral growth and coloration is maintaining so um, definitely awesome that me coral again you know you're going to have the highest standard with me coral they have probably the most pure products out there on the market so it's great to see that they have uh, these products available for those folks that have those low nutrient systems so this one wonder what it is let's take a look all right easy button what we have with me coral crave is a product that is going to make uh, dry pellets much more nutritional and offer a lot more value to fish and is going to help them color up and make them overall more healthy and one of the biggest reasons i got away from frozen foods is because of the time required to thaw the food out rinse the food then add it to the tank it added a lot more time and when you add that up daily it can dramatically have an impact on the overall um, health of the fish and you know a lot of times i just don't have the time for it where using something like this where you soak the pellets in the crave for a couple of minutes prior to actually feeding the fish you're going to give them the value that you would expect with frozen food and much more because it's in a concentrated form it's you know it's got amino acids omega-3s garlic it's going to do a lot for your fish and keep them healthy and i think that that is absolutely amazing probably out of everything that we've seen here this is the product that i'm most excited about and i'm definitely looking forward to putting it to work in my reef tank now one thing that i definitely think that's worth mentioning with these bottles is the ability to control with that dropper and just slowly add very minute amounts to the aquarium um, to hit that recommended dosage and not exceed the dosage you know by overshooting because there's been times where you know with other liquid additives that i've completely just spilled all over the place spilled in the tank and needed to do a water change after but having a element or a food enhancer or what have you with a dropper is going to allow you to really dial in your dose and i think that's definitely an important feature and something 
that needs to be noted when we're talking about these products. All right, folks, that's going to do it for our look at the Emmy Coral product line available at Premium Aquatics. If you want to do some more research on these products or even pick some up for yourself, there's going to be a link in the description below, which will bring you to premiumaquatics.com where you can do just that. That's it for today. I want to thank you guys for joining me. If you enjoyed this one, make sure you hit the thumbs up, and I will see you next week right here with a brand new video.